And myself and Mark, we've just been to the Canadian workshop, Hi. which was a really well presented lecture about their technical philosophy and their teaching methodology. Yep, so it was a really fantastic uh, on snow workshop, really interesting. A lot of the focus was on um, balance at foot level. Uh, and so we spent a lot of time looking at what, what should be focus on, focusing in on, on at foot level, feeling the whole foot, uh, feeling a bit of pressure on the shin of the foot. And the way that it was coached, it was very much about take one small task and then give the students plenty of time to get some repetitions and really reflect on the feelings that they're getting back from the slope. Um, and one of the main points that the, um, the Canadian coach was putting across to us that the, the danger with snow sports instructors is that we often give our students too much information. He said it was really important to just pick one, one task, one small piece of information and give the students time to get some repetitions and reflect on how this affects their performance. The, the four um, uh, technical areas that the Canadians concentrate on was one, uh, using all the joints, ankle, knees and hips. Uh, turning with the lower body was number two. Um, separating upper and lower body for, for edge grip. And the fourth one was coordinating movement patterns. So the Canadian, uh, they had a, the Canadians had quite a simple sort of structure they were using for their teaching uh, methods. So they had a, a, what they call a reference, which is similar to us in terms of a, a task. Um, then giving the student to reflect on that specific reference, uh, see if they can f feel where it takes them. And then, and then finally, using a lot of variety in terms of terrain, um, turn shapes, speeds, to see if they could always come back to that reference point. There was very much an experiential element to, to their teaching, where they'd give someone a clear reference, but then they'd give them time to reflect on it. And actually, they actually emphasised that the actual understanding may well come later, and it wasn't uh, initially that important that they understood it from the go.